So this week I'm doing a few odd jobs around the house because ever since I moved in, the house is pretty livable, but there are a few things that I just keep on procrastinating on because those jobs in itself aren't really the most interesting ones. I thought this would be a great video to show you the process of moving into this place. So as you are watching some clips of my unfinished apartment, I'm going to explain to you why the title says you're going to be watching a cooking video. So in today's video, I'll be working on a few of the odd jobs that I still have left to do in the apartment to finish it. Now, this is correct. My plan was to do a few things that I've been procrastinating on for the past few months. But this one project of the skirting boards ended up taking me about three days and I did, finished it halfway. It's not even finished. So my initial plan was to do the skirting boards and then have enough time left over to edit the moving in video. Unfortunately, sometimes things just don't go to plan. So as you see me working away on these skirting boards, I'm showing you first how not to do it, then the tool to buy to do it properly, and then I basically take a long, long time to figure out how to do these little around the corner bits. And the problem is not even that it's not nice to do this job, it's just that it takes such a long time. So the format of uploading weekly and this job don't really go well together. So let's fast forward to three days later. Good afternoon. I am taking way longer on the project than I thought I would. On the floor, as you can see, it's a mess everywhere. And I am overwhelmed. I was working on the skirting boards um, and a few of them I finished. All of this DIYing and it not going as I wanted to go has made me super hungry, super frustrated. <laughs> so I think the right thing to do is to cook myself something that I can enjoy, something to kind of make up for this half attempt at finishing the skirting boards. as you could probably already tell from the groceries I got, um, bolognese. But really, I don't think it's an actual pasta bolognese because apparently the way I know how to cook it, the way my mum used to cook it, is not the real way. It's not the authentic way of making a ragu, as I think, as I think they call it. So instead of being sad about the fact that for two weeks in a row, my video idea didn't work out, Oh yeah, so last week I tried to make a video on a shop jacket kind of with the idea to have a job uniform for when you're working from home but I wasn't really sure what the story was behind the jacket so I uploaded a different video instead and so in this video I'm just gonna cook myself some nice food and kind of tell you about the plans that I have for the rest of this channel I guess So I've been making a video a week for the past six weeks now and it turns out it doesn't always go as you think it's gonna go and I knew that before I started but now two weeks in a row I've had a video idea that didn't really pan out. It's something that I need to learn to deal with. I will, I do have a format in mind which is camping, camping in a vehicle. So like a van or like a stealthy car, uh, cooking and camping. Cause those are two things that I like to do. Uh, so I will be most likely buying a car or a tiny van in about a month. Oh, the onion. I guess this is already a bit of a, a trial run for me making a video about cooking and 
I'm just not camping today. Although we could be camping in the living room. I got a tent for my birthday. I'm so excited to, to get a car or a van to go camping in. Um, I've been looking at a few different models so far. At first I thought I wanted a truck, but having a truck here in the Netherlands is just really not practical. I'm thinking about something like a Ford Transit Connect I've been looking at because they're quite big uh, in back and they can be stealthy quite easily. I've looked at the Ford Galaxy. That could be even more stealthy but just less room. Um, I've looked at a Suzuki Jimny which is probably the tiniest possible car that you can buy to camp in but I'm not very tall and I think it would make for some funny videos. Some pepper, salt. This is smelling good already. I also thought about doing an episode where I get ingredients from the garden when everything is growing to do a cooking from my own garden episode. Um, I wanted to do that now already because the radish is really getting there, but they're not big enough. Actually, we can, let's, let's water the garden as I'm waiting for this. So radish. They're getting there. It's a little bit small though to be making a cooking video. The tomatoes in here. I'm not sure if they're doing well. I guess we'll see. They're being a bit overcrowded by the um, by the radish, and they they're getting these spots. The cherry tomatoes getting the worst of it. It's totally shaded. We should probably take those radish out, but I don't think it's gonna survive. It doesn't look like it. Sturgeon coming out. Some basil here. Onion. Carrot, Swiss chard, and some cosmos flowers. And here we have potato starting to come out. Potato plants and some spider webs. There's so many spiders here where I live. Yeah, so the garden is doing well. It's just that I can't really make a lot of content on it right now because it's just growing. My lettuce. Everything in here is doing very well. The tomatoes, more cucumber, some flowers still. And these cherry tomatoes are still rolled up like that, but at least they're not, they don't look like they're dying. Like that. My grandmother brought this for me from Grenada very cute and this is what nutmeg looks like so first you take off this outer bit and i thought a while back that this was the nutmeg but there's something in there you can't really hear that so you can open this as well and this is the nutmeg that's so cool and it smells really good the sauce I'm telling you, this doesn't look like the picture from the recipe, but when does something ever, right? If it tastes good, that's all I'm asking for. Ow, that's hot. Let's see if something went according to plan today. <laughs> mm. 
Mm. That was good. Not hot. Good first try.